everybody, it's Barb from The Shabby Tree where I'm always trying to inspire you all to be unique in your home in everyday fashion. Guess what? I am here for a quick tip. Now, if you're following The Shabby Tree, you all saw me make an amazing snowflake out of basic plastic white hangers. It came out amazing. If you did not see that or you're not following The Shabby Tree, you need to follow The Shabby Tree. We are whipping out DIYs left and right here and I am showing you a quick tip here for another snowflake that is amazing and all done from Dollar Tree items. So this is what you need. Now, you need six of these little white trees and they're from the Dollar Tree and I you need six of them. And then I also found in the Dollar Tree white duct tape, which works amazing for this little quick tip right here. So the purpose of this quick tip for me is I am a big Christmas person. I love decorating. I wanted some statement pieces for my yard and yes, the shabby tree is all about being unique. So what we need to do is open up all six trees, open them up. When you open it up, it will come with the three little legs on the bottom and then this plastic thing. You just pull this off just like this on all six trees and then you have this right here. Now, so you have six of them. What you're gonna do is take two pieces at a time and you're gonna connect them just like this. And all you're gonna do is wrap some duct tape right around. You can use the silver duct tape if you need to, but the white works amazing because it's not so noticeable. So. You take your duct tape, you have your two pieces together just like that. And all you're doing is wrapping these two pieces just like this together. Quick, simple, easy. So you're gonna do this process three times because you're doing two, two, and two. It's gonna give you three big pieces like this, which is gonna turn out to be the most amazing snowflake ever. Okay, so I'm just wrapping like this. I'm gonna rip this off just like this, okay. So I did this three times. I have one, two, and three. Easy as heck, guys. Now we are forming our snowflakes. So all I'm doing is putting them across to form like a cross, just like that. Just looks just like a cross. This one's gonna go diagonal just like that. And voila, we have a form of a snowflake. Now what you're gonna do is take some more duct tape. You are just going to wrap this around this form, just like this, to hold these three pieces together, just like this. So all I'm gonna do is I'm coming around just like this, and I'm going to rip one piece off, and I'm gonna come around just like this. So it's still not formed, so I'm gonna separate those ones a little bit more, and then I'm gonna go the other direction, with some more duct tape, just like this. So I went this way, now I'm gonna go this way, just like that. And all I'm doing is coming around, just like this. I'm gonna bring it around just one more time, just like this. And now I want this piece to stay in shape too. So I'm gonna do one more piece and we're gonna come this way. And then all you're gonna do is fluff it apart and you're gonna have the most amazing snowflake ever. Okay, so just keep coming around just like this. You can even, I can bring it back around one more time the other way. One more time this way. You just wanna make sure it's really good and secure, guys. It's really good secure. Your pieces are forming your snowflake just like this. It's all formed and secured in place just like that. And then you have it look just like this. You have it just like this. Yes, now all you need to do is fluff your pieces out just like this, you're just gonna continually fluff around. Now, I'm gonna hang these outside. They do not have to be hung outside. You can hang these in the house. You can put them flat against a wall. Now, what I'm gonna say you, to you is here at the Shabby Tree, I whip out ideas for you. <clears throat> and then you're supposed to go crazy, get unique, and come up with some other ways to do it. So what you're gonna do is, you're gonna have your basic snowflake here. And then, do you see how I'm fluffing it? You fluff all your pieces out just like this and you get, voila, the most amazing snowflake ever. Do you see this? Okay, all Dollar Tree items, quick, simple, easy. Now, what you can do is, the purpose of the shabby tree, I show you the idea, 
you're gonna get creative. So you're gonna add either sprigs to it, you can put ball ornaments on it, you can add a big embellishment in the center. If you wanna see how Mayan turn out after I add some embellishments, you just gotta jump to the Shabby Trees page later on. I will post pictures of the total finished project of all the embellishments I add to it, but guys, this is amazing. You can leave it just like this. Voila, you just gotta get to the Dollar Tree, find some basic white little Dollar Tree trees, and you can also grab the duct tape in there. Guys, I hope you enjoy my quick tips. I hope you're all following, and thanks for watching this quick tip.